So I'm gonna be doing another Christmas vlog today. I'm just gonna call it Vlogmas. I'm not doing, you know, 25 days of vlogs or 12 days of Christmas or any of that. I'm just gonna vlog when I can um, because it's December and I'm gonna call it Vlogmas. Um, so that's what's happening on my channel. But today, what I wanna show you is um, uh, what I'm doing for stocking stuffers for my family and an updated Christmas decor tour of my house just a quick one because I've put up my two decorating videos but I've added some more things since then plus my new couch came in so I kind of want to show how that looks with everything so to start right now I'm going to show what I have um, for stocking stuffers I went to the Dollar Tree yesterday I got stockings for everyone in my family um, except for my brother David. He won't be here this year. He has to work, but uh, there will be nine of us here, including like Weston, me and Conrad. So I have eight stockings to work on. Um, I've just been gathering like little odds and ends, like making lists, like what's everyone's favorite candy or, you know, things like that i'm trying not to spend like too too much money but still make it fun and festive because my mom always does like these beautiful elaborate stockings when we go to her house so i want to do something fun too i went to um, dollar tree like i said and i picked up um these stockings for everyone and they're really cute i mean for a buck and there's some monogrammed ones here too i didn't see um, everyone's letter so I just got what I could and then the rest here and then I got a lot of wrapping stuff at Dollar Tree too like this was a dollar for two of these bags and at Target I feel like it would be like 150 for just one of these so so yeah um, I scored at Dollar Tree yesterday um, so real quick I'm gonna show kind of what my plan is for everyone's stocking except for Weston's I'll show you his later um, because if I get his stuff out he's gonna want to play with it and freak out um, so yeah I'm gonna get started all right I'm gonna start with my husband Conrad's stocking um, so he always needs new socks so I got him socks that he can wear with tennis shoes some new native deodorant we're pretty much all natural now for as far as deodorants go so um, I know he's been liking native it's one of his favorite candies, um, TheraBreath, because my mom swears by this stuff, and who doesn't need a good mouthwash? I wanted to get like a little travel size, but they only had this at Target, so I'll just put that in. Shaving cream, so nothing crazy. I still have time, so if I find things, you know, over the next week or so, I'll add, but this is a good base. Like, everyone has a decent base going. All right, then I'm going to show my mom's. Um, so I went to Buff City Soap, which is a local soap um, place here um, in the Memphis area. But I guess they're nationwide now, but they started here. Everything's natural. Um, it smells amazing. So I got her a really beautiful bar of soap. It smells incredible. Definitely lush vibes like I don't really know the difference between lush and buff city as far as their ingredients um, But anyways, those are for her Keto chocolate almonds fluffy socks um, Sriracha aioli because my mom loves like dips and sauces and things So I thought she'd like this and I'm gonna throw a bottle of wine in her stocking as well to complete it and then here's for my sister Mia um, similar, I got her soap also, um, an eye mask, oh wait, my mom, no, okay, this is my mom's eye mask, like the anti-aging, I've never tried these, but, um, it sounded good, so that goes with hers, my sister, I got her the hydrating and glow, it's okay, buddy, it's okay, here, you wanna hold the socks, you wanna hold the socks for Aunt Mia, um, she loves lilies, these just great for travel these are little jewelry holders they're from target they're just a dollar they're ceramic you can paint them um i use them to hold soap too so yeah that's hers here's my other sister anna pretty much the same stuff travel dry shampoo and a mask instead of eye patches oh yes thank you socks 
here's my dad. I definitely need to get a couple more things for my dad, but it's just tricky. Maybe I'll do socks for him too. He likes Butterfingers. So I got him this. I got him this game so we can play that maybe as a family while they're here. A couple Sharpies because he is like the Sharpie king, always looking for Sharpies. This is my brother Nate's stocking. Loves Star Wars. So I got him this Darth Vader, <laughs> Vader. Darth Vader mug. And this was TJ Maxx for $6.99. So I know he'll love that. He has a thing for mugs. So especially if it's Star Wars, he'll love it. And then some Mandalorian socks. Mia and Joel swore that he would um, like enjoy these. So that's for him. And then he's not really a candy guy. So I get chips for him instead. And then let's see for Joel's stocking. Um, I got him Chewbacca, so he's gonna kind of match with Nate. Joel also loves Star Wars. I got him Reese's, and he just told me the other day that he loves like malted candies, so I got him Whoppers. And yeah, that's pretty much it for everyone here. And then when Weston isn't with me or he goes down, I'll show you his stocking because I've been having fun with his stocking um, too. What do you have over there? Q-tips? Mm. <laughs> Can I see them please? Mm. Thank you. So I said I was gonna do an updated Christmas decor tour too. Um, Weston and I just put these lights on his little tree. I think it looks so cute. That's all I did in here as far as Christmas. Um, so, you know, nothing crazy, but he loves lights on trees like our christmas tree or any other tree so i had this this extra string with all my light stuff so i thought um that would be really fun and he likes it tree uh -huh. every morning he gets up and we go look at our christmas tree do three claps because that's what turns the lights on and he just loves it do you like your tree <laughs> is that special? Yeah, it's yours. It's your very own Christmas tree. Isn't that cute? <laughs> yep. You're showing Bunny. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to walk in here now. And I have a couple new things to show you. I just got this console table like a week ago from World Market. I love it. We just put this snow day sign. This is an S. Snow day sign up here. And then, okay. you want me to hold you? Okay. Okay, hang on. Okay. okay. Yep, again. Again. And then, um, this garland, flocked garland from Target. It's the same one I have on the fireplace. Two, um, like, candle lights. Gosh, that airplane. It's like really annoying that's sitting there on the couch. Um, sorry, it's really bothering me. Um, okay, take four. I'm finally gonna show you my couch. Turned off that airplane, gave Weston a banana. <laughs> Maybe I'll have some quiet for 30 seconds. Oh no, it's back. Oh no, okay, okay, let mommy show the couch, then we'll play with the airplane, okay. So this is the Radley sectional sofa from Macy's. I love it. It's not the softest couch. It's pretty firm, but um, I think that means it'll hold its shape nicely. So it's okay. I'll take it. Um, yeah, it's nice. It's definitely like a gray, beigey. Pulls a little bit green in this room. You can see right here. I think because my floors are gray, it pulls a little green, but that's okay. Anyways, I got a couple new throws. Um, these were from Home Goods, and then some knitted pillows. Those were Home Goods. These I already had from Target. If you guys watch my decorating video, you saw that they're brown, and I flipped them over for now. I already had that pillow. Already had both of those pillows. Same throw. Another knitted pillow. So yeah, that's how this is looking. The wreaths are still hanging, so that's great. And then here, I messed with this a lot, but I really just wanted simple. 
So this is what we came up with. I found this. Um, at the Pottery Barn outlet when I went and got those um, candle holders back there. I love it. If they had like a whole set of these, I would have bought them because it was just, it's my favorite, like my favorite Christmas decoration in the whole house. I just think it's so pretty. Um, you want more banana? Here. You want some more? Nah. Yeah, you know more. Throw it away. All right, and then this little setup uh, you've already seen. Tree, I kinda wanna respray it. Um, I feel like a lot of the flocking spray has fallen, or I know it has, cause I'm always vacuuming it. Um, I'm still happy I did it, but I would like it even more white. So I may just add a little spray, cause I have it. Oh, and I have a new coffee table coming. I ordered a round one. Um, this coffee table's broken. It broke during our move. See how the leg is like wonky? And you can't really fix it because it's not real wood. So um, I have a new, yep, solid wood coffee table coming in. I'm still hunting for a new rug. So that'll all be changed pretty soon. Oh, you okay, buddy? You okay? You just slip? I'll help you. I'll help you. You okay what happened to your banana oh dear okay got the banana cleaned up so here I just changed this up a little um, my sister she got sent like a ton of chocolates from lint so she gave us a ton of her chocolate and we are so grateful they're delicious um, so I put that there you guys I had the hardest time finding like what I wanted to put above the stove. I tried probably three different wreaths. Um, this is what I came up with. It's on a timer. So it lights up around three o'clock. It gets dark here at like 4.30. So three o'clock we have it started. And then this one starts around the same time. So it is pretty once it's on and lit. Um, it just looks really nice. Um, nothing crazy over here. Our kitchen's a disaster, but I shouldn't say disaster. It's been a lot, lot worse. It's just a little bit messy. Um, and then I finally, I put this here. I don't love it, but what I did have, which is way too tall, we were always fighting with it whenever we sat down to eat. Whoa, whoa. Um, so I put it in this little pot that I already had. I finally figured out this console table. I wrestled with it for so long and I love how it came out. It's just simple. This is what I wanted. White, simple, put some twinkle lights, sign I already had, tree from Target, houses from Target, this, I think this one was Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby and Home Goods, I think was that reindeer um it was cool that i found him because over here i already had my little family set of reindeer going and he matches perfectly so yes so i like that um i kind of have a whole set now a little reindeer let's see what else is new what else what else is new buddy And then here in our entry, we started getting some Christmas cards in. Um, I made this as at an A&R workshop a few years ago, so it's fun. I need to get more of these um, little things because they keep breaking and all the cards are falling. But here, I already showed this to you guys, but I just hung some mistletoe. I said I was going to find some mistletoe to put here, so right when you walk in, it's just kind of a fun touch to have that hanging. This has twinkle lights also, it's just not on. Um, yep, and if you watched my decorating video, you know where all this is from. Um, and then I got this from Pottery Barn Outlet and I just love it, love it. Um, I can't wait to fill it with a whole bunch of photos. I'll probably do black and white. And I'm debating where to put it, I think I may put it here so when you walk in it's just 
I don't know, it's fun to look at, like people's pictures. This mirror, I'm actually not crazy about it. I feel like it's almost too small because I have so much wall space. <laughs> He's looking at himself. So it's either gonna go here or um, it would fit on this wall because I checked maybe here. But my concern is um, I already have all these photos. So I don't want it to be like, oh, she just has like a thousand frames up. So we'll see. Um, you guys look at this. Look at this. I have got to figure out a system of how to like organize these toys. I just, it's too much. All right, so the dining room is not too different from what I showed you guys earlier. Um, we had people over for dinner, so I pulled out the bench, put that there, and I did all chairs because we needed exactly six seats. So I do like that I can do that. Um, yeah, so this is looking like that. Our little bar cart. I would love to do like some twinkle lights here. I'm always changing things. And then over here, this is a little bit different than what I showed on my Christmas decorate with me. I, I just used stuff that I already had, everything I already had. There's Christmas cookies I made the other night with my sister and brother-in-law and Conrad and Weston. All right, so I just got Weston down for a nap. So I'm gonna show you um, all the things I'm gonna put in his stocking. So I have his stocking here. Um, and all this was like under $12. Let me show you. So this is TJ Maxx. I think he's gonna like freak out over this. Probably needs batteries. I think it's supposed to make something, but for six bucks, I thought that was pretty good for like a bigger car like this, race car. Um, this was from Dollar Tree. I just washed both these things. Um, this was Dollar Tree, so a dollar. Um, this was Pottery Barn Outlet. And it's a goat and it's like so freaking adorable it was three or four dollars it's originally you know probably 25 or 30 i don't remember but um i just thought it was so cute if this doesn't all fit in the stocking then i'll leave this one out but um these things will go in there uh this was dollar tree as well on the go he's still a little bit little to color but he'll do it for a couple minutes if i give him some grands and a book but um you know there's some little activities in here too and then stickers dollar tree he really likes stickers he likes to put them on himself but i thought um he would like that his favorite food you guys is olives <laughs> and chocolate and so i just got him this little can of olives that i'm gonna put in his stocking um so yeah that's everything for weston so far i think he's really gonna like this stuff so weston and i were building our little gingerbread house from target and he decided to eat part of the door <laughs> that tastes good there were two little pieces that are supposed to be like an awning for the door and he just like grabbed it and started eating them so but we're just letting it set and dry right now so far it's holding up pretty well i have a feeling i'm gonna run out of icing because i'm using a lot to like keep everything glued together and he's helping he helped me put icing on the door to stick it on you're helping to eat some of the pieces. It has all the instructions right here. Maybe we can have it look something like this in the end. <laughs> it's your first gingerbread house. First one. Is it yummy? That's the door.
Conrad's home. I'll either just start over or let Weston go ham on it. I think he's a little young for this still. He was just eating all the candy. Okay. I don't know. The um, Bachelorette finale with Michelle. So Mia and Joel are gonna come over. Um, and I'm making a charcuterie board right now. Hi, baby! Look, Mama fixed! Mama fixed your gingerbread house! Yeah, see? It's all better! It's all better! What do you think? You can look. I see it, Mama. No more candies, though, okay? I see your handiwork. I think it's dry. Oh, Wes, that looks so good! Look at what you did! <laughs> good job! Oh, you want to it eat really, candy, okay, really, okay, just one. <laughs> So funny, yeah. I thought he'd be more into like sticking stuff on, but. And then? No more. Like, no, this is one. the thing. Like, one more? No more, I'll die. One more. Uh, I don't know, you've had a lot of one mores. You're not gonna eat your. Mama might just make the house for you at this point. You want some pasta like that? Oh yeah, let's eat pasta. You want some pasta? I have the meatballs still cooking right now. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. One more, no more candy for you. All right, so here's our charcuterie board for Bachelorette night. I thought it was the finale, but I think there's actually one more night left. So Mia, help me put this together. Here we go. Got lots of meats, cheeses, crackers, gluten-free crackers, fruit, Brussels sprouts, nuts. Looks so good. Hey guys. I'm eating a little apple. Um, so it's the next evening. Weston and I just got home from a little Target run. So the decorating is like <laughs> never stopping around here. Um, so I just picked up a few more little things today. I'm gonna share what those are. And some more stocking stuffers. I'm pretty much done with the stockings, except for like one more gift. Uh, I'm gonna show you really quick. There's just a couple things that I got. Um, this I let Weston pick out in like the little dollar section at Target. It was three dollars, but I thought it'd be so cute just to add into his room. And I picked up this nail polish. I feel like this color is so trendy right now. So instead of going to get my nails done, I'm gonna try it. Um, I'm awful at painting my own nails. I might do it on my toes and see how it goes first. Bubby, you want to put um. The reindeer in your room let's go put it in your room come on and then this christmas pillow i couldn't pass up i just thought it was so cute i love that it was kind of a muted red you can see a little bit of white poking through lessons playing in the storage bins are you stuck do you want help are you trying to get out do you want to get out do you want to get out or stay in out? You can play with the lids. Come on. You can play with the lids. We gotta put the reindeer in your room, bud. Yeah, let's find a good spot for it. Yeah. All right, he's not coming, so I'm just gonna show the stocking stuffers. So I have everybody's stockings right in here. And then to top off my dad's stocking and my brother-in-law's stocking. So my brother-in-law, Joel, loves like bourbon and whiskey. So I just got him these two little, um, you know, little ones to put in there. And because he needed another little something. And then for my dad, I don't think he has one of these for his um, AirPods. So I think he'll really like that. And... A beanie just because it's so cold here it's five dollars so i'm like well that's a great um just little filler and yeah the stockings went well i mean everything pretty much fit in there let's go put this little guy up where's your reindeer where's your reindeer show me where is he yes he's really cute right there there he is 
All right, guys, that's gonna be it for this Vlogmas vlog. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Leave comments down below of um, just any content that you wanna see from me or questions or feedback. Um, I really appreciate it when you guys do that. So yeah, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I hope you are enjoying this beautiful Christmas holiday season like I am and just soaking it in. Thanks guys.